Hey kids, it's Pastor Sean. I love holidays. All of them, actually. I love Christmas. I love Halloween. I love Easter. Did you know that this week was a holiday? It's called Juneteenth. Not after Pastor June. It's named that way because the holiday falls on June 19th. June plus 19th equals Juneteenth. In 1862, President Abraham Lincoln signed the Emancipation Proclamation, which officially freed enslaved people in the United States. It took two and a half long years for the news to reach everyone around the country. In those days, the president's words had to be carried and read aloud to each state. Juneteenth celebrates the day people in Texas, the last state to hear the news, learn that President Abraham Lincoln declared the end of slavery. When that news finally reached Texas, enslaved people celebrated. From then on, people have marked this day as a day of celebration. Now, you and I have been doing a lot of hard work over the past year to learn about racism in this country and in the church. And we know that even though slavery has ended, black and brown people are far from free. Racism and hatred keep people held back and held down, unable to be totally free. Just because slavery has ended, it doesn't mean the fight is over. Those first organizers of the celebrations of Juneteenth knew that too. So while people danced and ate, they also did some work. Celebrations were sometimes rallies to encourage people to keep fighting, or demonstrations to teach people how to vote. Juneteenth is more than just a celebration. It's a chance for us to remind ourselves to keep working hard, to make sure everyone is truly free, free from hatred and discrimination, free from feeling hurt and pain because of who they are. On this day, we give God thanks for the end of slavery, and we ask God to help us to keep going in doing this important work of freedom and justice. Let's pray. Repeat after me. Thank you, God, for Juneteenth, for freedom and justice. Help us to keep fighting and find ways to make everyone more free. And we all say, Amen. Happy Juneteenth.